What's good, YouTube? Uh, Professor Snap here. I just wanted to make a video. Real, real sick. I'm gonna put on this and. What's up, YouTube? Uh, most of you guys know how to do this. Um, it's really not that complicated, but um, it'll still, you know, I'll still help you guys out. But this is the um, own fabric top button tutorial. It's gonna teach you how to. Um, put a like your own fabric here like let's say like I have this fabric and um, I want this up here right so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that so yeah that's the tutorial let's just get into it like in my other tutorials you're just gonna pry it like this you just get the scissors in between like this and then just kinda pry away now sometimes you'll get lucky and this metal part will still be here and you will just get the fabric portion and it'll look like this just kind of empty and so once that happens you know you've taken your top button or you've gotten you know the fabric like this or like you know like this um, you're gonna wanna um, take this out um, if this is still in here then you're gonna wanna take this out just kinda get a little blade and just start prying it out um, however you can, you know, of course, be be safe. Try not to um, cut yourself. Yeah, see, like, I'm just trying to get in between this thing and then just kind of pry it out. Uh, there we go, just like that. All right, so I pried that out um, from here. So don't ask where I get the top buttons. I just get the top buttons from another hat. Um, we're going to use this for fabric. This is going to be my fabric for the top button. So um, now that I got this, you can take all the fabric off, or you can leave it on and put it over, I guess, if you really want. But um, for sakes, I'm just gonna take the fabric out, and you're just gonna wanna like, you know, pry that out like this. All right, so now I got the just the metal part. I took the fabric off. See, here's the fabric. Here's the top button. But um, now I've got this one, right? So what you need now is the fabric that you want. Um, cut it a little big. Um. You know, because I, I really never know how much fabric I really need. Alright, so now that I've cut my fabric, I always cut my fabric a little more than I really have to, just to be safe. Um, all you're going to do is just put a little dab of glue, like where you want it. Like, um, I kind of want this corner right here. Um, I'm going to put it, like, right here, so I can kind of get all the colors. So, you know, if it's see-through, which you can kind of see it, you're just going to put a little glue where you want the top button. And then you're going to put the top button right on it. That simple. Just like that. Um, and then let it dry for a few seconds. About 10 seconds. And then um, once it dries, you kind of, I kind of like to like go in sections like this. Um, you see, look, now that it's here, I probably have a, a little bit too much fabric. So I'll cut edges kind of off. Okay, so now I've got a little bit of fabric. I just you just fold it over like this. Can you see that? And then hold it down with your fingers. Um, and then usually as I go, now that I've done like kind of half of it, what I do is I put a little glue in the middle, like um, kind of in between my fingers and stuff. And then I start folding it over again, and I hold this side down. Um, so then those the flaps that I just put on can glue you know again this is kind of a crappier job um, if you do it really nice you can get it so that it's not really like square like this but um, I'm just showing you guys the gist as with all my tutorials because it's kinda hard doing these in a camera so um, alright and there we go so now I'm gonna fold this over put last glue in there and gonna there we go. Just kind of glue it down. Let it glue. Um, if there's any excess like material, then go ahead and cut it. Um, this material is pretty thick, so um, it would be a little harder not to get, you know, kind of messy like this um, without the edges. But it is possible. Um, I've done it quite a few times. So yeah, that's that. All right, YouTube. So the um, I did I redid it, or I did this. Um, if you take your time, you gotta take time. It's kind of hard doing this in the in the mirror. Just like really take your time and kind of go around and 
try and crease out all the edges. This material is really thick, so um, it was kind of hard, but this one's a lot better than the one that I did. Um, you know, just a little bit up here, but um, I'm not really worried about that. I think it kind of adds character to the top button, so I'm not even going to trip about that. So, now that you have the top button with your fabric, you're going to want the, you know, of course, the hat that you want to put it on. Um, you're going to want to take the top button that's already there off. Um, just like that. And then you're going to want to put the, um, the top button on. Just glue it like you've seen in my other tutorials. Um, you know, this little prong was still here, so I'm just kind of, yeah, see, look at that. Just taking that out. And then now I'm just going to put glue on it and then glue it on. So here we go. Just, um, I like to put glue on this part like this. And then I um, I grab the top button, and then with my finger under under the hat, I put the top button on, and then apply pressure on both sides. So I'm like, yeah. So you can see here, right there and there. And then I just let it dry, and then that's it. So yeah, um, so that's it. Um, hope you guys like it. If you guys have any um, questions about it, like. Um, then please, you know, ask it. Go ahead and feel free. And that's about it. So yeah, rate, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching my vid. Peace, guys.